boys and girls, it's story time day! Woo, woo, woo! I am Miss Beth and I am here to share a great story with you. All right, today's story is going to be Kitten's First Full Moon by Kevin Hanks and the publisher is Green Willow Books, an imprint of HarperCollins Publishers. All right, Kitten's First Full Moon. And this, as you can see on here, this is an award winner. So this is a Caldecott. So it won an award for the pictures that were drawn. So take a close look at those because they're quite good. All right. Kitten's first full moon. It was Kitten's first full moon. When she saw it, she thought, there's a little bowl of milk in the sky and she wanted it. Now here's what she's thinking is a little bowl of milk. So she closed her eyes and stretched her neck and opened her mouth and licked. But Kitten only ended up with a bug on her tongue. Poor Kitten. Still, there was the little bowl of milk just waiting. So she pulled herself together and wiggled her bottom and sprang from the top step of the porch. But Kitten only tumbled, bumping her nose and banging her ear and pinching her tail. Poor kitten. Still, there was the little bowl of milk just waiting. She chased it down the sidewalk, through the garden, past the field, and by the pond. But Kitten never seemed to get closer. Poor Kitten. Still, there was the little bowl of milk just waiting. So do you think that's a little bowl of milk or do you think it might be something else? And if you think it's something else, what do you think it is? If you said the moon, you are correct. If you guess something else, well, we'll keep reading and we'll find out if you're right. So she ran to the tallest tree she could find and she climbed and climbed and climbed to the very top. But Kitten still couldn't reach that bowl of milk and now she was scared. Poor Kitten, what could she do? Then in the pond, Kitten saw another bowl of milk and it was bigger? What a night! So she raced down the tree and raced through the grass and raced to the edge of the pond. She leapt with all her might. Poor kitten, she was wet and sad 
and tired and hungry. So she went back home. And there was a great big bowl of milk on the porch. just waiting for her. Lucky kitten. And that is the end of Kitten's first full moon. So, did you get it right? Did you realize that that was just the moon and its reflections? That's true, poor kitten didn't get that bowl of milk from the moon, but they sure got that bowl of milk when they got home. So that is good. I am Miss Beth and I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. I hope you have an absolutely fantastical day and I cannot wait to see you next time.